who is the most despised TLC husband, sister wife's patriarch Cody Brown or Seeking Sister Wife star Garrick Merrifield? Both believe that they are God's gift to women, Cody with his six-pack abs, whereas Garrick has single-handedly convinced his wife, Danielle, to divorce him in the name of God so he could be with other women. Therefore, who is worse in the long run? Fans have weighed in so keep watching for the answer. Did Cody Brown walk so that Garrick Merrifield could run? Cody came onto the TLC scene in 2010 with a fully functional plural family. He had three wives, 12 children with one on the way, and was courting a fourth wife. They were able to make the household run and live in one home with Cody, making a smooth rotation to each wife. Things did seem to change when they moved to Las Vegas as each wife had their own home and Cody clearly favored his fourth wife, Robin. As time went on, his second and third wives, Janelle and Christine Brown, found their voices amid his favoritism. They stood up to him and would not let him dictate any longer. By the end of season 18, he was down to just one wife. As for Garrick, he heard a calling from God several years back and decided he needed more wives. He and his wife, Danielle, have attempted to recruit women, typically from Brazil, but it is just failing. A Reddit thread was started, noting how Garrick and Cody would make great friends and pointed out why. I think they're both narcissistic jerks that hide behind God on their absolutely awful decision-making. The only difference is Cody found his young side piece, Garrick is still trying to buy his. One comment from above noted that the TLC stars seemed like the same person. However, another added that Cody Brown appeared to have gotten into polygamy for religious purposes. He genuinely wanted to have multiple wives and create this very large family. However, Garrick Merrifield has been using God to justify all of his female encounters. Yet, in the end, when it comes to who is worse as a parent and overall human being, Cody takes the cake. Cody is a POS because of what he did to his sons and kids if I bring up what I really want they will probably remove it. Robin can have him we all remember that haunting line. So ick is disgusting and perverted but Cody has done so much irreparable damage to his kids at ex-wives belittling them on TV when he belittled the wives he belittled the kids too. It's disgusting, Cody to choose his fourth wife and her five children in the end and has been estranged from several of his older children. Yes, his late son Garrison Brown, who died by apparent suicide, did say that Robin could have him. Garrick and Danielle have subjected their kids to too much, but it does not appear that they have said anything close to what Cody did to his kids. Cody did choose his fourth wife and her five children in the end and has been estranged from several of his older children. Yes, his late son Garrison Brown, who died by apparent suicide, did say that Robin could have him. Garrick and Danielle have subjected their kids to too much but it does not appear that they have said anything close to what Cody did to his kids. In the end, Cody Brown has become the most despised TLC husband. For his he though, a win is a win. Do you agree with this? Let us know. However, police in Flagstaff, Arizona have released body cam audio documenting the moment that officers discovered the body of late sister wife star Garrison Brown. In the audio obtained by TMZ, an officer can be heard stating that Garrison is deceased and that an unloaded firearm was found in his lap. The officer also states that the death appears to be a suicide and that no note was found at the scene. Garrison took his own life in March at the age of 25. In a second clip, an officer contacts two of Garrison's roommates to inform them of his passing. One roommate, Cheyenne, breaks down in tears and states that she heard an unusual sound coming from Garrison's room the previous night. A second roommate, Addison, is also informed of Garrison's death. She confirms that Garrison was struggling with alcoholism and depression and that he was intoxicated the night of his suicide. In previously released body cam footage, a third roommate spoke about Garrison's struggles with alcoholism. He drank a lot and said he was going to stop this month but I didn't ask him about it or anything," roommate Tyler Sanford told one officer. He would try and limit himself, like this month, he was going to try and go the whole month. I feel like when Lent started, he said he was going to give it up for Lent, but I don't think that lasted," Sanford explained. I've never been around a heavy alcoholic, but I would hear him stumble sometimes, but he never, like, seemed too out of it. But I wasn't hanging out with him all the time. In previously released text messages, Garrison admitted to struggling with suicidal tendencies. I gave Gabe my firing pistons a while ago, I know you guys worry about my suicidal tendencies, 
Garrison texted his mother, Janelle Brown, at one point. In the weeks since his untimely passing, Garrison's family has continued to honor his memory in various ways. Last week, Janelle honored her son on what would have been Garrison's 26th birthday. Happy birthday, sweetheart. We are missing you terribly today. It's hard to believe you aren't here anymore. Janelle wrote on Instagram. We talked a lot about you today and even went to Texas Roadhouse for dinner, your favorite place. The grieving mother continued. I still feel you nearby sometimes, and I'm grateful we will see each other again when my journey is completed. Obviously, Janelle will never fully recover from the loss of her beloved son. But those closest to the reality star say that she's taking solace in the love of her family, especially her three grandchildren. Our thoughts go out to the entire Brown family during this enormously difficult time. However, before Garrison Brown's passing, there were suspicions that Cody and Robin Brown were in the market to add a new sister wife. Now Sister Wives fans think the new addition should be a younger woman with kids. In early March, before the devastating news of Garrison Brown's suicide, suspicions were running high that Cody and Robin Brown were wife hunting again. Although the plural marriage with Cody, Mary, Janelle, Christine and Robin didn't pan out, there's a chance a different wife might. In many ways, they seem to be looking for the perfect plural family that Robin always dreamed of. With the untimely loss of a family member, all plans might have changed. However, Sister Wives fans think it could do Robin some good to have a younger Sister Wife. Furthermore, viewers saw how the early seasons of Sister Wives show Cody, Mary, Janelle, and Christine Brown managing a busy happy family under one roof. Additionally, it walks fans through the process of Cody courting his new wife, Robin Brown. Undeniably, introducing a new woman into the mix comes with huge transitions. Likewise, Robin entered the marriage with three kids from her earlier marriage. Without a doubt, plural marriage is a delicate dance to balance all the wives' and family members' needs. But when Robin joined the family, many of those factors shifted to her and her family. On Reddit, a Sister Wives viewer brings up a valid point about Robin Brown. First, they say, the only way Robin Brown will see what she did to the family. Furthermore, they discuss how Robin will only understand how she affected the balance of the family if she goes through something similar. They recommend she experience bringing in a new younger wife with kids to feel the full effect of how she shook up the managed equilibrium in the original Brown household. More so, the Reddit user wants Robin Brown to feel the same pain the other wives went through, saying, bring on a younger sister wife and see how misplaced it will feel. Let her monopolize all of Cody's time, referring to the favoritism that Robin had from Cody Brown, also pointing out the way that other wives were feeling during Cody and Robin's honeymoon. Continuing, how about they go on a 14-day honeymoon see how it will feel, especially with Christine Brown's pregnancy with Truly happening at the same time as the courting, wedding, and honeymoon. Undoubtedly, the established three wives were going through many emotions while Cody and Robin were on their 11-day honeymoon while the large family stayed home. Additionally, the user brings up a difficult issue in Mary Brown's life since she was struggling with only being able to have one child, saying, how about the new younger wife can give Cody children and you can't how would that make you feel? This is the only way Robin Brown will ever feel the pain she brought. In particular, the Sister Wives fan wants Robin Brown to get a taste of her own medicine. In like fashion, they want her to feel what it was like for Mary Janelle and Christine to have a younger wife come into their established plural marriage after 16 years of not adding a new wife. While Robin played a part in the unraveling of the plural family, some believe it wasn't just her fault. However, Others think she was the root cause of the dismantling of the harmony that originally existed in the family. However, other Sister Wives fans don't think Robin Brown would ever let this happen. Unfortunately, they don't believe she has the capacity to extend empathy or understand the pain of others. What do you think? Will Cody and Robin Brown add a new wife? Do you think they would go for a younger wife? Do you think Robin would learn from the experience? Is Robin as conniving as some people think? Are you ready to see more Sister Wives episodes? Drop your comments below.